This is just a message for all you men out there. Women are expensive. Some are really expensive. So, date within your price range. Choose accordingly. Don't get your feelings hurt. That's one of the reasons why so many guys are tapping out. So many guys are saying I'm out. Why would a guy spend his time and money on you if all he's going to get in return are your attitude and baggage? If you're a dude, please take something away from this. Today I went to the beach and I was alone. And two separate guys came up to me to hit on me. First guy is mad creepy, blocks the sun, starts asking me personal information about myself. But I'm giving him like short one word responses and he's just not getting it. Basically, she was not attracted to the first guy. Like he's not taking the hint. And eventually I just go, hey, I don't want to talk. And he's like, you don't want to talk? And I'm like, no. And he goes, you have horrible energy and then walks away. She wanted the guy to leave. The guy left. So what's the problem? What else did he do? Versus the second guy comes up to me, compliments me. I say, thank you. He asked me if I'm on vacation. I'm like, no, I live here, whatever. He introduces himself. His name is like, hi. He's like, hi, I'm Brendan. I'm like, hi, Brendan. She was attracted to the second guy. And that was the difference. Had the second guy done what she said the first guy did, she would have been okay with it. But he gets that I don't want to talk, so he goes, all right, I'm going to let you go, but I just wanted to let you know that. And he leaves. Don't be Mr. Horrible Energy. Be Brendan. Okay, men, so I have a legitimate question for you. Do you ever think about the way that you're going to come off to a woman when you're going up to them and introducing yourself? Why does that even matter? If she doesn't like the guy, she's going to shut him down regardless. Because today, this guy literally just yelled at me out of his car and he was like, Stop the cap. Hey, you look beautiful. And I'm like, thanks. I mean, why not? And then I just keep walking, obviously. It sounds like she wanted to tell everybody that she got a compliment today. And this guy literally turns around in his car, does a U-turn, and then goes around to the next street so he can come up and stop me and ask me like, Hey, what's your name? How are you doing? What do you do? That's what guys used to do back in the days when they used to approach women. It's like, do you not understand that that could be so creepy? I Like, I know... It came from like a pure place that wasn't meant to be creepy. Once again, guys, she didn't find him attractive enough. But you don't just stop your car and then turn around and then stop someone and be like, hey, how are you? It's kind of weird. Just think about it, please. Well, I'm out, man. Just a little PSA for you. No woman wants a man that has his eyes on every woman. If anybody can get your attention, and everybody has access to you, I don't want it. And vice versa. The lie detector determined that was a lie. That explains why women never go after guys with options. What a bunch of BS. Probably the best couple. The like, best couple. The best, the best non-couple that I've interviewed. Look at us. Who would have thought? Not me. I feel bad for that dude. That was not a good night. If your girl starts going to therapy while you guys are dating, Psycho! You're the problem.